Well, recall the Stokes theorem. It says the circulation of a vector field F around the boundary C of an oriented surface S in the direction counterclockwise with respect to the surface unit normal vector N is defined this way. Now we have another theorem that we call the divergence theorem. So the divergence theorem says the flux of a vector field like F across the closed oriented surface S In the direction of surface outward unit normal vector field is defined this way. So you have the double integral f dot n ds d sigma, which is your outward flux, is equal to the triple integral not log dot f, you have the divergence dv, over D. D is the region enclosed by the surface. Very good. Let's take a look at one example to see what's going on here. Example says, find the flux of our field F is defined as x, y, y, z, and x, z outward to the surface. of the cube cut from the first octant and the planes x equals to one, y equals to one, and z equals to one. Very good. So let us follow the theorem that we have here. The flux f dot n d sigma over s is equal to the triple integral of not blood dot f. So let us calculate not blood dot f first. This is equal to partial derivative with respect to x, partial derivative with respect to y, partial derivative with respect to z, dot f. Which gives us, well, the partial derivative with respect to x is going to be y, partial derivative with respect to y is z, partial derivative with respect to z is x. So, so far so good. We have y plus z plus x, and then dv. As you can see, we have fixed boundaries. So you can write it as 
dx, dy, dz, or any order that you like. Just using a very simple triple integral here. So here we have 0 to 1, 0 to 1, x y plus x z plus a half x squared, 0 to 1, then taking the integral with respect to y and z, if you just want to follow the triple integral. 0 to 1, 0 to 1, you get y plus z plus a half dy dz becomes 0 to 1, a half y squared plus yz plus a half y, 0 to 1, then dz. This guy is equal to a half plus z plus a half or 1 plus z dz, 0 to 1. So you get z plus a half z squared, 0 to 1, 1 plus a half, which is 3 plus.